Yo guys, Ray it's Tom here and welcome back to another video. As in the title, a brand new flashback Joe Hart has been released by EA Sports to celebrate um, him having either like the most golden gloves or something like that. Um, but yeah, as you can see on the screen, he's a 91 rated card. He obviously plays for Tottenham these days. Um, so yeah, in this video I'm going to be showing you or telling you guys whether or not he is worth it. Um, but yeah, he looks a decent card, but... You know, like I said, I'm just going to be discussing, discussing whether or not it's worth it. So, you know, before we do get into it, make sure you do smash the like button, boys. Subscribe if you're new. And uh, without further ado, we shall get into it. So, as you can see now, the SBC is an 85 rated squad, which is currently coming in at around 170k. So, that is without any informs, 170k for a flashback Joe Hart. And is that worth it? Off the bat, I'm just going to say no, it is not. We just go to the goalkeepers from the Prem. We can have a look here. We can see, obviously, here's the highest rated one. Um, And then if we go compare him to Allison, let's say, Allison has a better card, pretty much. And if we go compare them price-wise, um, so if we go to Allison, um, search on the transfer market, see how much Allison's going for these days. Yeah, as you can see, Allison's, you know, downwards of 100k. So a less cheaper player, a player with better links, um, and obviously a tradable card as well. This flashback card obviously means he is untradable. So that does obviously hinder him a little bit. But if you guys are a Tottenham fan and you are or a Brexit 11 team, you know, we've all seen them on TikTok, people that have to pull English teams, then obviously go ahead and complete him. He is a nice card. He's a night nice rating as well, 91. But I just want to compare him to someone who we all love and hate. Um, we all have a love-hate relationship with him. I think we all know who's coming up. I think I do have him in my club. We have the big boy Nick Pope. So I obviously has his got I have his gold card and I have his inform. So I'll quickly have a look how much his inform is. And even if the stats don't portray it, I can already tell you that this Nick Pope's already better than him. Um so if I go to concept players again, we'll we'll get the Joe Hart in and we can compare their stats. So we'll stick the Joe Hart in. Um so yeah, as you can see, Joe Hart obviously has better stats, um, a lot better stats in some cases in some places, but Nick Pope in form would be tradable if you were to go buy him cheaper as well he's probably around how much is this um probably around i don't know what 80k is it um if we type him if we'll type in nick pope but what i'm trying to say is you can get a lot cheaper players from the prem with better links um than this joe hart who are obviously tradable and tradable players are better because obviously if you don't like them you go ahead and sell them and obviously joe hart if you don't like him you can't go ahead and sell him um you're in a bit of pickle in that case. So yeah, 70k for an inform Nick Pope. Whereas this Joe Hart is 100k more, 170k. And we all know how good Joe Hart, uh, how good Nick Pope is. He is six foot five. Um, but then comparing that to Nick Pope, Nick Pope is six foot seven, with comes for crosses, saves his feet, which is brilliant to have for a goalkeeper. Um obviously, and then if we look at Joe Hart, he only has cautious with crosses, which isn't that's pretty shocking as well, isn't it? Um Obviously, if you, if you get stuck making his mind up, that is going to be very uh, catastrophic for you guys. But um, yeah, is he worth it? In my opinion, definitely not. But again, like I said, if you are a Tottenham fan or you a fan of Joe Hart for some reason, um, or you just want to, you just you know you like collecting cards, then obviously go ahead and do him. He has got a decent card. Don't get me wrong. It's just the price. Obviously, the price will go down once the uh, mid icon uh, or prime icon, sorry, um, player pick has been removed obviously fodder is at an all-time high with that SBC currently out but um yeah decent card not the best not the worst very overpriced so i'd definitely say not worth it you can even you can go pick up an informed pope who's going to be just as good even better you can get an allison who will have better links to other leagues and you know allison's good as well and he is very he's 70k cheaper so yeah definitely players that are better than the show heart but then again it is up to you guys if you do want to go ahead and complete him you go and do that but um, yeah, hopefully, boys, this video did help you out. If it did, make sure you do smash the like button, subscribe if you're new to the channel. And um, yeah, make sure you turn on those notifications as well so you do know when I upload a video. Go join the Discord, which is linked in the description, boys, and drop me a comment below what you think of the card. And uh, hope you guys enjoy it. If you did, hopefully I'll see you in the next one, boys. Until then, peace out.